I don't trust these bitches, they will never catch me slipping. I don't trust. Mother. Mother. Sucker. Right. What is our purpose? What is our purpose? Purpose. It's a funny word. You see, it depends on the context or the arena that you happen to be in. You know, uh, your purpose in relationship is not going to be the same in your career, you know, so it depends on what what you're doing. You know, sometimes your purpose is really simple. Sometimes it's just to relax, to get some rest. Sometimes just to listen, uh, you know, so, you know, it depends. But anyway, I'm digressing here. What is our purpose, our collective, our true north, if you will. And I think our purpose is to grow. And I know that sounds vague and I've started to dislike the word grow is so generic and maybe overused but it's useful and uh, I'll explain what I mean anyway so <clears throat> what I mean by growth is if you look at Maslow's hierarchy of needs you know you've got this pyramid and it's a ladder starting at the bottom and uh, working your way up and obviously there's a hierarchy of needs in the sense some needs are more a higher priority than another not better than another, just higher priority than another. And I believe our purpose, both individually and collectively, is to climb up this ladder. And on a side note, if you look at the chakra system, what you notice is that there's very strong similarity between Maslow's hierarchy of needs pyramid and the chakra system. Even the colors are similar as well as the needs themselves. So both can be used as a, a guiding map, if you will to gauge which needs that you need to meet yourself uh, and collectively too. Uh, I guess one is more easy to believe from a face validity perspective. So yeah, that is what I believe our needs are. Obviously we're, we're at different stages depending on countries, you know, what's what's fulfilling one's potential to a, to a person who doesn't know when the, where the next meal is gonna come from, you know. So we have different needs depending on which countries you live in, depending on individual, with family, etc. Yeah, we're all in different stages of the pyramid. You know, it's not as uniform as it could be. Some of us uh, have our emotional or esteem needs met without our basic or safety needs met, you know, sometimes. If you do look collectively though, as a whole, I think we're still very much at the bottom of the pyramid. Um, I mean, most of the world is still living paycheck to paycheck. Most of the world's primary concern is still physical or emotional safety so so yeah it's not <clears throat> we're not high up but uh, that's just a testament of how much higher we could be not so much how bad we're doing and uh, i think it's a it's a positive thing you can look at it that way uh if you if you want yeah so i mean to sum it up our purpose is to grow to climb up the ladder of needs and to do this to help each other individually and collectively to do this as well, uh, I think it's important. I think we could all be doing better. I think I could be doing better. I think collectively we could all be doing better to help each other climb this this pyramid because imagine a world where more of us are self-actualized. Imagine what we could achieve. Imagine a world where we've met our basic needs and no one needs to work in order to have health or have their very basic needs met. Imagine that. Uh, so yeah, I think that's our purpose. I think that is what we're, I think that is where we are headed as a society. And you know, we've got things like the UN and all that helping, apparently. <laughs> yeah, so, <clears throat> yeah, so that is our purpose. Our purpose is to help each other and ourselves climb the pyramid or the hierarchy of needs. So thank you for watching the video. I hope you benefit from the information that I have just shared with you. If you like the video, make sure to click the like button and uh, subscribe if you like the content. Uh, this is 3 of 50, right? Uh, I'll see you again tomorrow.